Hi boys and girls, Colonel Popcorn here. Today we're gonna to talk about one of my favorite artists. His name is Pablo Picasso. Uh, he was born in Spain and then grew up in France later on. He was considered a modern artist. Do you know how to say hello in Spanish? It's hola. You see somebody go hola. Uh, in France, you say bonjour. That's in French you say hello, bonjour. Anyway, I'm going to sh show you a few pictures of Pablo Picasso, a few different uh, parts of his life. Here, for example, I have one in this book, which I like very much. This painting is called Guernica, and Guernica had to do with a place in Spain where they had some real problems. But you see how he draws, like, for example, that's a horse, kind of funny looking, or this person with a hat on, coming out of the walls or out of a door. And here's somebody having a problem, as you can see. Here's a bull. Like, for example, it's a close-up of the bull with this, looks like a woman. This would be maybe a little, it's what they call surrealistic, which is like dreamlike. So what he does is make sort of dreamlike pictures. A horse doesn't really look like this, but that's how he sees it. Here's a picture of Picasso and his sister, Lola, uh, when they were both very young. Uh, Picasso started painting very, very early in his life, and at age seven, he actually started taking uh, lessons. And then he grew up to be one of the most famous artists in the world, famous of all time. This painting uh, by uh, Pablo Picasso is called The Swimmer. It's very dreamlike uh, in how he did this. You can't really tell where the hands or the feet or the head uh, are, but you sort of see it's this figure swimming around in what looks like the water, the blue water. And that's very typical of how he painted. A lot of fun. These are the kind of things that you can do. This painting is called Interior with a Girl Drawing. So you see the girl there, she has kind of a funny sort of profile with her nose sticking out and her eyes over there. And her, Look at her hands, they don't look like regular hands. The way he painted was he just sort of did it the way he felt like doing it, not exactly how it looks. And you actually see somebody leaning on a table there too, so you have a girl somebody leaning on a table, and then you have what looks to me like a painting frame, or maybe it's a mirror and a plant. She's got long, stringly legs hanging out. That's just the way he painted. He made nice colors on, on almost everything he ever did. This is the kind of thing you could do as well. This painting is called Portrait of Dora Mar. Uh, she was a good friend of uh, Picasso's, and so she posed for him. What's nice about this is that he uses so many colors, and he paints a profile as well as looking at her right from the front. And you notice her hands, they're not normal looking, or her the red fingernails are kind of cool, and even the way she's dressed. It's not the way you would normally see things, but the way he saw it, everything had a sort of strangeness to it. This is sort of a cubist, what they call cubist kind of art. So you see angles and round shapes and all that sort of thing. I love this painting, I hope you do too. I have an idea. Why don't you try to make a painting in the style of Picasso? Uh, I have a picture of a little girl, Aubrey Cannon, which she tried doing that, and as she progressed, the painting changed and she made it into her own style. I'm also going to show you a video of her painting and to see, you can see how it changes as she goes along. I think you're going to like this. We now are watching Aubrey Cannon. She is doing her interpretation of a Picasso portrait. She's first outlining it on canvas very carefully she's watching and she's observing how you do this take heed she's an artiste from 
One's from Paris, but now she lives in Wesley Chapel. Okay, so, so here we are. Mademoiselle Aubrey Canon finished her painting. Look at that, it's a portrait. I actually really like what I did before, so I just painted over it light blue, and then I took some of this. Okay. And then I just painted it, and took some yellow, just made a look, look, funky look, look, person. Look at the painting. Look at that. These that's are nails, wild. big nails. Oh boy, I like this a lot. This, now you see, that's like real modern art. Congratulations, young lady. You get the ribbon of the day. Bravo! Bye.